Okay, today we're going to find out what's in this Fram high mileage oil filter additive package. This is what's inside there. And I'm sending this out to Blackstone Laboratories. And they're going to do an oil analysis on this and give me the results. So let's get started. It looks like it has a got a good go. Be nice and tight. Get your inner here. Filtration of 99 here. Okay, a couple days ago, I made a video of this Fram high mileage oil filter. And what I'm going to do today is a viewer asked me if I could get this analyzed. He said he'd make a great video, and I, I agree. If I can get this additive analyzed. So what I'm going to do is, I've got a Blackstone Lab kit here, and I've got a letter. I'll show you the letter afterwards, actually. But what I'm going to do is, I'm going to put this, they said, uh, put it in their kit and send it to them. So what I'm going to do is, I don't think it's going to fit in the bottle, though. Oh, yeah, well, it doesn't, it doesn't. Let's see. Hmm. This is the anti drain back valve, so that don't matter. I wonder if I can put it on like that. Me. Nee. That don't work either too good. You know what? I'm gonna tape all this. I'm gonna tape it up, and I'm gonna because they want to. They want me to send them the whole plastic thing, which it's all sticky anyway. It's kind of gluey, sticky. And here's what they wrote me. Uh, thanks for the photos. Interested substance to find. I've heard about their colleagues about it. They confirmed with. I told you on Friday. All right. Blah, blah, blah. $38. Um, to send it to us, feel free. Use one of our sample containers, which I have. If it will fit, please try to include the whole inner cartridge. Okay. Which I am. I'm going to try to get it all in here. But I think I'm just going to put the cap on that and uh, send it to them that way. So I finally got the test results from Blackstone Lab. There it is. And what it mostly had in it was calcium. You can see a high amount of calcium, 6,058. 17 ma magnesium, 2 zinc, nothing down here. 75 silicone, 2 boron, 3 iron. To aluminum. And here's a note. We were able to test the substance you found in the new oil filter. This spectral analysis shows it contains a high level of calcium, silicone, and magnesium are present in it too, as well as a few other trace elements. We suspect <laughs> this substance may be calcium sulfonate additive, a non mixed form. Calcium Sulfonate is used as a detergent, dispersant, additive, and oil to keep solids in suspension for filtering. Its presence in the, the filter may be an act as a booster to the detergent 
dispersant or additive already in the oil. So actually it's, you know, if you look at, we've got a paper here, tells you what the additives usually are, calcium. It's usually a detergent additive, so it's mostly, I guess for high mileage oil, they would want it to keep your engine clean. But as far as, um, and a little bit of magnesium, but as far as any kind of, uh, you know, sealer conditioners or anything, I I guess they maybe they don't do that. I should have asked about that. They, if there's a, there's, you know, because this, they, they just do oil analysis, really. So, but this is what's in it. A lot of calcium. That's a, that's a high number of calcium. I don't know. It's usually, do they have an average here? See, they got 550 as an average. But yeah, a lot of calcium. I'll just put this here for a second. You can freeze frame this and look at it. Yeah, so that's it. That's all there was about that that I could find out about it. A lot of calcium. I guess that helps, you know, keep the, your high mileage engine cleaner. So they just load it with calcium. Uh, you know, what's me? I think I'll skip the oil filter with the high mileage oil filters and just put my own high mileage oil in it if I want. Hey, so I think I'll wrap this video up. If you like this video, please hit that like button. Thanks for watching and take care.